AI avatars, LED fashion, luxury shifts what's trending in tech and style today? Find out. Hi. I'm here today to bring you the latest fashion tech news that you need to know. My name is Anina and I'm the CEO of 360 Fashion Network. Before we start, if you want to receive this news roundup regularly then hit that like button and smash that follow as we will be bringing you this news every week to keep you informed about the top stories we believe are important. Alright. First up, how Chinese influencers use AI digital clones of themselves to pump out content. Taiwanese influencer Chen Yiru's 15-hour live stream of eating chicken feet using an AI avatar disclaimer led to backlash and a loss of 7,000 followers, despite his 9 million Weibo fans. The use of AI avatars, like Chen's, is increasingly common among Chinese influencers in e-commerce, enabling round-the-clock content creation. While big names benefit, Smaller streamers face job insecurity as media companies prefer cost-effective digital personalities. China's live streaming industry, now heavily commerce-focused, employs 1.23 million individuals and is projected to generate 4.9 trillion yuan in sales in 2023, a substantial part of the e-commerce sector. Influencers play a crucial role by showcasing products, engaging viewers, and boosting sales. News Source the Guardian, next up. Brazilian cotton hits the runway at Sao Paulo Fashion Week. In celebration of Jean's 150th anniversary, Brazilian cotton producers stole the spotlight at Sao Paulo Fashion Week. The fashion show, curated by the Suda Alga movement, exhibited 40 denim-based outfits, emphasizing cotton's vital role in creating these iconic garments. The runway event featured models strutting denim outfits, highlighting the material's association with jeans. Paula Martinez, a renowned Brazilian fashion figure emphasized the indispensable contribution of Brazilian cotton to the manufacturing of these denim garments. Fashion icon Paulo Martinez, who styled the show, emphasized the crucial role played by Brazilian cotton in creating the denim pieces, underlining its significance in the world of fashion. News Source, Reuters, Another Piece of News Richemont sees growth easing as economic worries rise. Luxury conglomerate Richemont expressed concerns about global tensions impacting consumer spending. The owner of Cartier and high-end Swiss watch brands reported first-half profits below expectations, causing a 6% dip in its shares. Reflecting a broader trend among luxury retailers, Richemont observed a slowdown, echoing sentiments expressed by other high-end brands like LVMH. The waning post-pandemic spree has led to reduced demand for luxury goods in the United States and Europe, where escalating prices prompt cutbacks in spending, especially among younger consumers. Bernstein analyst Lucas Olka noted Richemont's entry into the Moderation Club, with constant currency sales growth easing to a five rate from July to September. This shift signifies a broader trend of reduced growth in the luxury sector. News source, Business Soft Fashion, next. Dutch fashion designer uses 3D printing to create futuristic LED dress. Futuristic 3D printed dress by Chromatic and Anu Quiprecht, a collaboration between Chromatic and designer Anu Quiprecht introduces a pioneering 3D printed dress that interacts with its environment using embedded LEDs, a breakthrough in integrating electronics within 3D printed elastomers, marking a new phase in fashion technology. Highlighting the practicality of their 3D printing, the dress showcases nearly 75 LED domes seamlessly integrated into the fabric without traditional methods like adhesives or stitching. Chromatic sees potential applications in various sectors such as running apparel, bags, footwear, automotive, and aerospace interiors, among others. The dress features Chroma Flow 70 appliable and heat resistant material capable of stretching over four times its length without breaking. This remarkable flexibility positions it for use in various garments, including intimate, leisure, sportswear, and swimwear, offering both comfort and durability in their designs. News source, TKT Magazine, and the last news items for today. Google reveals plans to make AI chatbot Bard as popular as YouTube, and Google Search. Google reveals plans for Bard, an experimental AI chatbot, aspiring to join the elite group of products with a user base of 2 billion, a milestone achieved by only a few platforms. The AI-powered chatbot, 
BARD, aims to assist users in brainstorming and retrieving customized internet information, to make AI more accessible and beneficial to everyday consumers, as shared by product lead Jack Provchik at the Reuters Next conference in New York. Google's plan involves integrating BARD's capabilities with Google Assistant, initially accessible on mobile devices, as a strategy to introduce AI to a wider audience, news source, business today. Here are the week's top 5 news. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items of the week check out our new podcast 360 Fashion or go to 360fashion.net slash podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode. Get to su-